Good afternoon, everyone. I am back with my Dollar Tree haul. I did a haul earlier that was from an out-of-town store where I found my black and white checkered plates. This is from my local store, and they did not have anything that I found um, at the out-of-town store. I, um, yeah. So I just thought I'd share it with you all, um, what I got from my store. I think Coco wants to say hello. Oh, there's Coco. But Trenton and I went into our local Dollar Tree yesterday, and excuse me, didn't really find anything new. So I was glad that I went out of town and found um, some new items. Coco is just a big love bug. I'm filming this on Sunday, but I will actually post it on Monday. So, but I just thought, well, I wanted to get it hauled and put away. Um, so that way it's put away in the cupboard, out of sight. So, yeah, it's a beautiful day here in Northern Indiana today. Absolutely gorgeous. I'm gonna, Tyler's helping some friends at a pumpkin farm today. So I'm gonna probably go down and get some pumpkins here in a little bit. Cause he just texted me and said um, that he's still there. So yeah. But I'll go ahead and show you what I hauled from my local store, which wasn't anything new. Um, but I will say, if you're going out to your Dollar Trees, be on the lookout. They are rocking it this year for Christmas with the decorations and things. Absolutely wonderful. So many cute things I just love. And I'm usually not one to um, get a lot of Christmas stuff, but I have this year so far. So I'm anxious to see if they come out with more as this as we get um, past fall and Halloween. How much, how, if they bring anything else new out. I'm on the hunt, I know for myself, uh, for the adult coloring books that they had last year at Christmas time. I'm gonna be on the lookout for those. Those are the top of my wish list. So I'll just quit rambling and show you what I found. A lot of food items. You know, I had made the comment on my Walmart haul the other day that um, I was buying my kids Pringles and we hadn't seen anything like that at the Dollar Tree. Well, lo and behold, I walk in and what do you think I see? Not Pringles, but I see these Lay's. And so I stocked up on those. I've got, um, I think, yeah, I got three of the barbecue of the Lay's chips, um, three of the sour cream, scoop them back there three of the sour cream and then I have two of the cheddar we opened a cheddar one up to have some and then I bought I thought I bought more of these but the kids probably confiscated them um, of the Lay's original so they did have those I saw those at every store I was at yesterday I do believe so that is a super good deal um, for name brand chips, a dollar. So yeah, I definitely grabbed those because I was buying the Pringles and they were, I think they're like a dollar 60 something. So getting these for a dollar was amazing. I was needing some more grape jelly. So we like this jelly, no complaints here on the Dollar Tree brand. So I picked two bottles up we like the toastums, and so I picked up three of the frosted. Um, oh, these are I got one of the frosted strawberry, one of the frosted cherry, and another one of the frosted cherry. So we've always had the strawberry, so it'll be new to try the cherry and see what those taste like. Each week I haul these because they're name brand, and you just can't beat the price for Kleenex. And these are the puff, and you get puffs. They're 96 in a box. So I picked up two more boxes. 
And then I always get these almost every week. They're the Cascade pods for your dishwasher. I absolutely love these Cascade pods, so I buy them um, every time I see them. I grab like one or two. Trenton wanted some of these Brim's Crunchies. I picked up two bags, but I know he's got the other bag. And they also, he also picked these up. They're the TGI Fridays Potato Skin Snacks, Cheddar and Bacon. Pick, he picked up two bags. I don't know if he liked them that well because the other bag's out here on the counter. And I know Tyler tried them and he said they had a different type of taste to them. So I don't know if these will get eight. If not, I'll take them, the unopened bag um, to work and somebody can snatch them up. I always do this, the strong, the strong and soft toilet tissue paper. Absolutely love it. I always stock up on this each and every week. So I got two packages, but I do. And my store has been stocked with the toilet paper and the paper towel. They have been very well stocked. Another item that you know I haul each and every week is the paper towel. I purchase the, I call it a select a size because you can do different sizes to fit the need that you, you know, that you need. So I picked three up. And it's really good paper towel. I have no complaints, none whatsoever. I also picked up the laundry detergent. I love this laundry detergent. It smells so good. So, so good. So this is what I use in my laundry. I picked up, because I use these myself, so I pick them up at the Dollar Tree. I use Post-it notes at work a lot. So I picked me up two more packages of the Post-it notes and you get 200 in here. So I picked up post-it notes for me to take to work. Scratching my arm. I picked up some vinyl gloves. I use them to clean. I use them when I color my hair. So I always get these. They didn't have the blue kind. I usually get the blue kind, but I've bought these before and you know, they're protecting, protecting your hands, I should say. Something else I always buy when I go to the Dollar Tree and they have them in stock. And all of the Dollar Trees I went to yesterday had an abundance, huge, huge, of the face mask and there was no limit. So I picked up one, two, three, four, five, six. Six packages. And I showed you in my last video the basket that I have on my table um, that I have these masks, hand sanitizer, and antibacterial wipes. I have them on the table. The kids know to grab a mask. If, you know, if they don't already have one, grab it and out the door you go to school. So I'm gonna put these over here. So I always buy that. Um, and all of you always make such nice comments about my hair and my color. And I get my hair color from the Dollar Tree. I have never had any issues with the color from the Dollar Tree. And this is the color I color my hair with, is right here. Um, they call it dark brown. This is what I use. I absolutely love this hair color. I used to go to the beauty salon and spend upwards to $50 to get my hair colored. Not anymore. Not anymore. I use this on my hair. I have absolutely no problem. I have people tell me all the time how soft my hair is. I've even had, um, when I get my hair trimmed, they're just like, your hair is so soft. Um, and I use all beauty products from the Dollar Tree to wash my hair with. Um, I do use a um, name brand uh, gel for my hair, but everything else I use from the Dollar Tree. So I picked up three boxes, so I have this on hand. I usually color my hair uh, 
about once a month or every six weeks because I do go gray and it's always around here. So yeah, and I just, I do it myself. I absolutely love it. And the money I have saved by doing it myself is on the plus size. Plus side, I get these trash bags. When they have them, they work great. You get six in a package. They have the drawstring. I like the draw, drawstring trash bags. Um, so I always get the ones with the draw. Ugh, I can't talk with the drawstring. Some candy to take to work. And then my last items. The Dollar Tree had an over, I mean, over abundance of disinfectant, um, wipes, sprays, sorry, I'm, wipes, sprays, you name it. They had like this whole um, area of it. And I asked if there was a limit and they said no. So I bought one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, seven of these good and clean disinfectant wipes. I bought them for here at home and I'll take some to work to wipe my desk down, my keyboard down, my mouse down, um, my, anything. These are so good to use. And people were really, really buying them. I saw people go in there and this is all they had. So, and Dollar Tree wasn't limiting them because everybody was asking and they, they had plenty. So everybody was getting, you know, their wipes. So I did, I stocked up because I thought, you know, who knows when they're going to get them in again, because it's been a while since I've seen these in my Dollar Tree. So I did, I bought seven. So yeah. And that was my Dollar Tree haul. I didn't find anything new. I thought I bought some of those picture frames. Nope, I got one more bag. I thought I bought some of those picture frames that I hauled um, in my earlier video, but I didn't. So I'm going to have to go back and get those because I want to do a gift, you know, a gift with those. But I do have some Christmas items. Like I said, the Dollar Tree is rocking it with the Christmas items. I, I don't know if this is the same one I hauled earlier. I don't think it is, but look at this says happy holidays look at that absolutely gorgeous for a dollar absolutely gorgeous a dollar then I got these for my cubicle at work it's what Tyler picked out last week they're the LED um, snowmen and they light up I got the snowman and I got the Santa and they have an elf but I didn't really care for the elf so I just stuck with the snowman and Santa I'm going to take those to work when it comes time. And then I bought more of these bulbs because I absolutely love them. I hauled them last week. They're absolutely gorgeous. And I cannot wait to hang these on my Christmas tree. Look at this. They're color changing glitter balls for your tree. Look at that look at that absolutely gorgeous i picked up one two three and four four more of these they call them the led glitter ornament and i saw these um at some of the stores i went to yesterday they just had tons of them they're absolutely gorgeous i think it's going to be beautiful um addition to my christmas tree I absolutely love those. Love, love, love. So that was my Dollar Tree haul. My store has not gotten much new in, in any other department. So I'm hoping that they do. I want to get some more of those picture frames that I hauled um, earlier. And yeah, because I, I wasn't using my head when I, when I picked two up. I was just like, oh, I'm going to get two of those. And I can put, you know, pictures in them for my um, cubicle at work. But then I got home and I'm like, oh my gosh, I should have thought of that for like my niece and my nephew-in-law to get them some. They just bought a house. That would have been a nice housewarming gift. So I think I may head to my store 
I don't remember if they had them there or not. Um, so darn it, darn it, darn it. But that was my Dollar Tree haul. I am thankful I did go out of town and find some of the black and white checkered plates and other items on my wish list. So I'm just very thankful for that. So that's my Dollar Tree haul. So I hope you all have a great week. Enjoy it, be safe. If you're new, please consider tapping the subscribe button and then the bell so you get notifications when I post a video. Have a great week, everyone. Please stay safe. I hope the weather is beautiful where you are. It's hard to believe we're gonna be, I'm looking at the calendar, you know, Wednesday, we're gonna be in the middle of September already. It's hard to believe. So have a great, great week, everyone. And I'll see you in my next video. Thank you, everyone. And please, one more thing. Thank you for helping my channel grow. I am almost at 5,000 subscribers and I could not do this without all of your love and support. So thank you. Keep sharing my videos. Keep coming back and watching. I appreciate it and my family appreciates it. So have a great week everyone and I'll see you soon in my next video. Bye bye.